Does this vessel have an entry permit? Uh, entry permit? Relax. I got one. Here. That's as old as they get. Seems in order. You may pass. Prepared in advance. Could say that. Thirty odd years ago. That's what the guy meant by old. Lucky us, huh? That could have ended badly. Finally back on land. Uh, barely. They call it the Walls of Water. But it ain't just the walls. Just the whole damn city. Which is why we can't traverse the town by conventional means. We'll need to rely on gondolas instead. Yay! More boats. Hey, not huh? this. Catch. Uh, oh. Key to the boat. What? Don't you want to go sailing again? Are you sure? Why not? Old girl ought to be sturdy enough. Not even an awful driver like Reggie could sink her. A king can't rule with wisdom alone. He needs perspective. So get out there and see the world, you hear? What's next? Immigration? What do you mean? There's still more? Sir, what is the purpose of your visit? Purpose, uh... Ignis, a little help? Oh, utterly hopeless. We are scholars of the culinary arts, and we've come to study the renowned cuisine of your fair nation. Is that so? I wish you an enlightening stay. Another one you owe me. Check Wescombe's place out? Yeah, let's all go to Mago. Perhaps we'll even make it in time for tea. And we'd better start looking now. Bet the view's even better from a gondola. So, we're looking for the guy from the picture. An estranged friend of the king. Not. You ever meet him? Nope. You see this, Noct? What about it? I could eat a horse. Huh. So what next? Watch 
should I buy? Man, that smells good. Let's go find some girls. Shop till you drop. You're not staying at a hotel? Fancy rooms were never my style. Need food? Managed to stay fed all these years. Not gonna starve to death now. And old Wes will see that I don't go thirsty either. Let's head back to our room. Shop till you drop. Any ideas for accommodation? <gasps> They're extending the exhibit for Lady Lunafreya's wedding dress. <gasps> the Vivian Westwood? But wasn't that a memorial for her passing? Well, now it's a memorial for her safe return. Let's go see it while we still can. Oh, could that be the dress we read about in the papers? Doubtless. The designer's name is the same. Want to check it out? That depends on the groom. Might still be a sore spot. What with his wedding getting called off. Who says we can't call it back on? It can still happen. True enough. Let's keep an eye out for it. If we win at the arena, let's grab drinks to celebrate. <clears throat> Hello, boys. Feel free to browse at your leisure. Thank you very much. Oh, 
It is quite lovely at twilight. Yeah, but there's something lonely about it, too. Delicious food, spectacular view. All I need to make this perfect is a lovely lady. Well, you're stuck with me. <laughs> Two out of three ain't bad, right? Badass, huh? And nice enough to lend us her lance. Assuming she's... How are you today? What's up, Iggy? I've come up with a new recipe. <laughs> Can't wait to try it. <sighs> you found a cactuar? Hold on to that. It'll make a great souvenir for Talcott when we get back to Lucis. Gentiana. Ahead lies a future uncertain, yet sure is the astral memory wherein the king may walk.
come on. Let's go see the dress. Oh, let me look up the nearest stop. It's not far. We can walk it. Sounds like we're close. Greetings. Very well. Welcome back. Will you be requiring a room? See that over there? What about it? Gondola! Care for a ride? How about a ridela on the gondola? Shop till you drop.
Hey there. Have a good look. See you later. That's it. What's what? I've come up with a new recipe. <laughs> I could taste test for you. something Welcome to Okoro lads. Sid mentioned you'd be dropping in. Waskamama, as you've gathered. My word, you've grown little prince. <laughs> ah, but of course. <laughs> you were only a babe at the time. Shop till you drop. There's no way the Nifs don't know about Lady Lunafreya's speech. <sighs> With both Leviathan and the Ring in one place, we can bet our asses they'll come out in full force. Let's grab a bite. <sighs> Let's head back to our room. The Empire effectively runs the show here. You lose sight of that when there's so much else to see. Welcome! You won't find fresher fish anywhere else. Would it be rude to ask about eating? Pleasure. If Ravis is in town, seems it's only a matter of time before that Chancellor shows up. Another unknown we don't need. Come again. You see that fish? I wonder where you can catch it. Dunno! Why don't you ask the shop? Um, couldn't be bothered. Oh, I know what you mean. I'm awkward around people, too. <laughs> yeah, right. Let's grab a bite. So, someone... Based on the government's actions, it would seem Accordo is supportive of the Oracle. Despite being under the Empire's thumb. Therein lies the riddle. Is Lady Luna Freya truly safe. What should I buy? Man, this city really comes alive after dark. Time to enjoy the nightlife. Now I see why people flock from far and wide to the walls. Where should we stay tonight? So this is your maiden visit. Enjoying it so far? You doubtless have many questions, so ask away. This country is a part of the Empire, isn't it? Oh, you're wary. I understand. But there's no need to jump at every shadow. Just be aware that the terms of our independence grant the Empire free reign to come and go as they please. We'll bear that in mind. It's admittedly a one-sided arrangement. Most everything we do requires Niflheim's permission. And they wouldn't knowingly permit the Oracle to appear before the public. How our government spun that is quite a mystery. You really think Luna will make an address? If every recent radio broadcast is to be trusted, absolutely. Where is Lady Lunafreya? 
in the city somewhere, but no one has caught so much as a glimpse of her. The media has been conspicuous in its silence on the matter, which speaks volumes of government intervention. That certainly explained the rumors of disgruntled Imperial officers leaving the city. So you see lots of nifs around here? We do, sometimes even at my place. Theirs is a familiar presence, and the citizens don't think much of it. Though the High Commander did cause a stir when he showed up the other day. Ravis. So soon after they felled the Archean and Lucis, his arrival fuels rumors that they will next come to Altisha. The Empire's not content ruling all the land. They want the heavens as well. Has anything changed with Leviathan? For now, it's business as usual at port. But word is the government will soon open the altar of the Tide Mother. In preparation for the right. Ah, but on the other hand, they're scrambling to stockpile emergency provisions. This begs the question, if they're anticipating that the Hydrian will wreak havoc, why would they allow the right to proceed? Well, if you need anything else, you know where to find me. Thanks, appreciate it. Oh, my dear Camellia, it's been a while. I heard about your distinguished guests. Ah, you've an ear for gossip. Gentlemen, I won't waste your time. My name is Camellia Clostra. First Secretary of the Accordo Protectorate. You should know, we have Lady Luna Freya in our care. And the Empire demands we surrender her. What? Yet I am loath to acquiesce unless we stand to profit. Hence I've come to discuss terms with the King of Lucis. If you've a mind to talk, come to my estate. She can be oblique at the best of times, but I assure you, her heart is in the right place. Oh, okay. At any rate, you must be weary from your journey. Might I suggest you seek your beds for now and ponder matters anew in the morning? Yeah, I think we'll do just that. Let's take a look inside. Remember, your heart is yours to follow. Just see to it that you proceed with caution. Should you ever need it, Marco is at your disposal. Now I see why people flock from far and wide to the walls of water. Splendid. Where are we off to? Gen... Gentlemen, it has been a pleasure.
Fantastic. Call when you need a ride back. He just stood there, staring at the church and looking all sad. Can you blame him? Greetings. We could crash right here. Taken. Maybe I can make a living out of this. Hmm. We need to go talk to Camellia. Yeah, like we have any other option. There's no telling how events will unfold. Let us prepare before making our way. Yeah, she can sit tight a while. So, care to take a cruise? Shop to the drop. I was hoping to get a picture or two around here. Let's check it out. Yeah, let's go! photo. I know just the place. And it's close. Let's check it out. Yeah, let's go.
Do you see that, Noct? What is it? This way to the dress? Yep, same street as the estate. Seems we're on the right track. So what next? Peace be unto the province. Splendid. Where are we off to? I just feel like there's no point in going into work anymore. Like I'm not welcome. Uh, you're overthinking it. Come on, let's go somewhere. Take a shot from here. Good call. Now it's picture time. them gains? Yeah, I think this group's only got room for one muscle head. Then Gladio better step aside, cause these guns shoot to kill.
Thank you. Come back whenever you need supplies. the jacket. It's nice to not have to kill anything. Yeah.
this arm so cool. I mean, not like I actually want one of my own or anything. No, dude. I told Wes is a local through and through. You need help getting by, you ask him. Got it. He can be a little slick, but he ain't a bad sort. Reggie trusted him, and you can too. City's built like a maze. Take care not to get lost. So, care to take a cruise? Westwood store should be up these stairs. It's farther than I thought. Seems everyone is making for the shop. 